The 2006 FIFA World Cup was the 18th FIFA World Cup, the quadrennial international football world championship tournament. It was held from 9 June to 9 July 2006 in Germany, which won the right to host the event in July 2000. Teams representing 198 national football associations from all six populated continents participated in the qualification process which began in September 2003. 31 teams qualified from this process, along with the host nation, Germany, for the finals tournament. Italy won the tournament, claiming their fourth World Cup title. They defeated France 5-3 in a penalty shootout in the final, after extra time had finished in a 1-1 draw. Germany defeated Portugal 3-1 to finish in third place. Angola, Ghana, Ivory Coast, Serbia and Montenegro, Trinidad and Tobago and Togo made their first appearances in the finals. The 2006 World Cup stands as one of the most watched events in television history, garnering an estimated 26.29 billion non-unique viewers, compiled over the course of the tournament. The final attracted an estimated audience of 715.1 million people. The 2006 World Cup ranks fourth in non-unique viewers behind the World Cup in 1994, 2002, and 1990. As the winner, Italy represented the world in the 2009 FIFA Confederations Cup. Host selection. The vote to choose the hosts of the 2006 tournament was held in July 2000 in Zurich, Switzerland. It involved four bidding nations after Brazil had withdrawn three days earlier. Germany, South Africa, England and Morocco. Three rounds of voting were required, each round eliminating the nation with the least votes. The first two rounds were held on 6 July 2000, and the final round was held on 7 July 2000, which Germany won over South Africa. Bribery and corruption allegations Accusations of bribery and corruption have marred the success of Germany's bid from the very beginning. On the very day of the vote, a hoax bribery affair was made public, leading to calls for a re-vote. On the night before the vote, German satirical magazine Titanic sent letters to FIFA representatives, offering joke gifts like cuckoo clocks and black forest ham in exchange for their vote for Germany. He abstained, citing, intolerable pressure, on the eve of the vote. Had Dempsey voted as originally instructed, the vote would have resulted with a 12-12 tie, and FIFA president Sepp Blatter who favoured the South African bid, would have had to cast the deciding vote. More irregularities surfaced soon after, including sudden interest of German politicians and major businesses in the four Asian countries, whose delegates were decisive for the vote, in the months leading up to the decision, just a week before the vote. The German government under Chancellor Gerhard Schroeder lifted their arms embargo on Saudi Arabia and agreed to send Grenada launches to the country. Daimler Chrysler invested several hundred million euro in Hyundai, while one of the sons of the company's founders was a member of FIFA's executive committee. Both Volkswagen and Bayer announced investments in Thailand and South Korea, whose respective delegates Wo Rawi Makudi and Chung Jong Moon were possible votes for Germany. Makudi additionally received a payment by a company of German media mogul Leo Kick, who also paid millions for usually worthless TV rights for friendly matches of the German team and FC Bayern Munich. On 16 October 2015, the German news magazine Der Spiegel alleged that a slush fund with money from then Adidas CEO Robert Louis Dreyfus was used to influence the votive four Asian members of the FIFA Executive Committee. The sum of 6.7 million euro was later demanded back by Dreyfus. In order to retrieve the money, the organization committee paid an equivalent sum to the FIFA, allegedly as a German's share for the cost of a closing ceremony, which never materialized. Wolfgang Niersbach, president of the German Football Association, denied the allegations on 17 October 2015. 
saying that the World Cup was not bought, and that he could absolutely and categorically rule out the existence of a slush fund. The DFB announced they would consider seeking legal action against Der Spiegel. During a press conference on the 22nd of October 2015, Nierbach repeated his stance emphasizing that the 6-7 million were used in 2002 to secure a subsidy by FIFA. According to Niersbach, the payment had been agreed upon during a meeting between Franz Beckenbauer and FIFA President Blatter, with the money being provided by Dreyfus. On the same day, FIFA contradicted Niersbach's statement, saying, by our current state of knowledge, no such payment of 10 million francs was registered by FIFA in 2002. The following day, former DFB president Theo Zwanziger publicly accused Nia's Bark of lying, saying, It is evident that there was a slush fund for the German World Cup application. According to Zwanziger, the 6.7 million euros went to Mohammed bin Hammam who at the time was supporting Blatter's campaign for president against Issa Qualification 198 teams attempted to qualify for the 2006 World Cup. Germany, the host nation, was granted automatic qualification, with the remaining 31 finals places divided among the continental confederations. 13 places were contested by UEFA teams, 5 by CAF teams, 4 by CONMEBOL teams, 4 by AFC teams, and 3 by CONCACAF teams. The remaining two places were decided by playoffs between AFC and CONCACAF and between CONMEBOL and OFC. Eight nations qualified for the finals for the first time. Angola, Czech Republic, Ghana, Ivory Coast, Togo, Trinidad and Tobago, Ukraine and Serbia and Montenegro. Czech Republic and Ukraine were making their first appearance as independent nations but had previously been represented as part of Czechoslovakia and the Soviet Union respectively. Serbia and Montenegro had competed as Yugoslavia in 1998, as well as making up part of Yugoslav teams from 1930 to 1990. As of 2014, this was the last time Tunisia, Saudi Arabia, Sweden, Togo, Angola, Czech Republic, Poland, Ukraine and Trinidad and Tobago qualified for a FIFA World Cup Finals. Australia qualified for the first time since 1974. Among the teams who failed to qualify were 2002 third-place team Turkey and Euro 2004 winners Greece. Additionally, Belgium failed to qualify for the first time since 1978, and Cameroon failed to qualify for the first time since 1986. For the first time since the 1982 World Cup, all six confederations were represented at the finals tournament. List of qualified teams The following 32 teams, shown with final pre-tournament rankings, qualified for the final tournament. Venues in 2006, Germany had a plethora of football stadia that satisfied FIFA's minimum capacity of 40,000 seats for World Cup matches. The still-standing Olympiastadion in Munich was not used even though FIFA's regulations allow one city to use two stadia, Dusseldorf CELTU Arena. Bremen's Wesserstadion and Mönchengladbach's Borussia Park were also unemployed during the tournament. Twelve stadia were selected to host the World Cup matches. During the tournament, many of them were known by different names. As FIFA prohibits sponsorship of stadia unless the stadium's sponsors were also official FIFA sponsors. For example, the Allianz Arena in Munich was known during the competition as FIFA World Cup Stadium, Munich, and even the letters of the company Arlenes were removed or covered. Some of the stadia also had a lower capacity for the World Cup, as FIFA regulations ban standing room. Nonetheless, this was accommodated as several stadia had an UEFA five-star ranking. Match officials, squads, 
Squads for the 2006 World Cup consisted of 23 players, as in the previous tournament in 2002. Each participating national association had to confirm its 23-player squad by 15 May 2006. Groups Seeds The eight seeded teams for the 2006 tournament were announced on 6 December 2005. The seeds comprised Pot A in the draw. Pot B contained the unseeded qualifiers from South America, Africa and Oceania. Pot C contained eight of the nine remaining European teams, excluding Serbia and Montenegro. Pot D contained unseeded teams from the CONCACAF region and Asia. A special pot contained Serbia and Montenegro. This was done to ensure that no group contained three European teams. In the special pot, Serbia and Montenegro was drawn first, then the group was drawn from the three seeded non-European nations, Argentina, Brazil, and Mexico. It had been predetermined that, as the host Germany would be placed in Group A, thus being assured of the venues of their group matches in advance of the draw. FIFA had also announced in advance that Brazil would be allocated to Group F. On 9 December 2005 the draw was held, and the group assignments and order of matches were determined. After the draw was completed, commentators remarked that Group C appeared to be the group of death, while others suggested Group E. Argentina and the Netherlands both qualified with a game to spare with wins over Ivory Coast and Serbia and Montenegro respectively. Group system The first round, or group stage, saw the 32 teams divided into eight groups of four teams. Each group was a round-robin of three games, where each team played one match against each of the other teams in the same group. Teams were awarded three points for a win, one point for a draw and none for a defeat. The teams coming first and second in each group qualified for the round of 16. Ranking criteria If teams were level on points, they were ranked on the following criteria in order. Greatest total goal difference in the three group matches. Greatest number of goals scored in the three group matches. If teams remained level after those criteria, a mini-group would be formed from those teams, who would be ranked on most points earned in matches against other teams in the tie greatest goal difference in matches against other teams in the tie greatest number of goals scored in matches against other teams in the tie. If teams remained level after all these criteria, FIFA would hold the drawing of lots. In the original version of the rules for the final tournament, the ranking criteria were in a different order, with head-to-head -head results taking precedence over total goal difference. The rules were changed to the above in advance of the tournament, but older versions were still available on the FIFA and UEFA websites, causing some confusion among those trying to identify the correct criteria. In any event, the final tournament saw only two pairs of teams level on points. Argentina and the Netherlands at seven points in Group C, Tunisia and Saudi Arabia at one point in Group H. Both of these ties were resolved on total goal difference. Also, in both cases the teams had tied their match, so the order of ranking criteria made no difference. Finals Tournament The finals tournament of the 2006 World Cup began on 9 June. The 32 teams were divided into eight groups of four teams each within which the teams competed in a round-robin tournament to determine which two of those four teams would advance to the 16-team knockout stage, which started on 24 June. In total, 64 games were played. Hosting although Germany failed to win the cup, the tournament was considered a great success for Germany in general. Germany also experienced a sudden increase in patriotic spirit with flag-waving, traditionally frowned upon by German society since World War II, whenever the German team played. For the closing ceremonies, Matthias Keller composed a work performed simultaneously by the Munich Philharmonic Orchestra, the Bavarian State Orchestra and the Bavarian Radio Orchestra with conductors Christian Thielemann, Zuban Mater, and Maurice Janssens.
and soloists Diana Damrau, Placido Domingo and Lang Lang. Traditional powers dominate despite early success by Australia, Ecuador and Ghana. The tournament marked a return to dominance of the traditional football powers. Four years after a 2002 tournament in which teams from North America, Africa, and Asia made it deep into the knockout stages and Turkey finished third, all eight seeded teams progressed to the knockout stages, and none of the quarterfinalists were from outside Europe or South America. Six former champions took part in the quarterfinal round, with Ukraine and Euro 2004 runners-up Portugal as the only relative outsiders. Argentina and Brazil were eliminated in the quarterfinals, leaving an all-European final four for only the fourth time. Scoring despite the early goals that flooded the group stages, the knockout phase had a much lower goals per match ratio. A prime example of the dearth of goals was Portugal, which only scored in the 23rd minute of the round of 16, and did not score again until the 88th minute of the third-place playoff. No player managed to score a hat-trick in this tournament. Italy, Germany, Argentina, Brazil and France were the only teams to score more than one goal in a knockout match. Germany was one of the exceptions, tending to play an attacking style of football throughout the knockout stage which was reflected by the fact that they scored the most number of goals, with players from all three outfield positions making the score sheet. Germany's Miroslav Klosar scored five goals to claim the golden boot, the lowest total to win the prize since 1962. No other player scored more than three goals. No player from the winning Italian squad scored more than two goals, though ten different players had scored for the team. Tying France's record in 1982 for the most goal scorers from any one team. For the first time ever in the FIFA World Cup, the first and last goals of the tournament were scored by defenders. Philipp Lahm, the German left wing back, scored the opener against Costa Rica after only five minutes of the opening match. In the final, Marco Materazzi, the Italian centre-back, outjumped Patrick Vieira and headed in the last goal of the 2006 FIFA World Cup. Unprecedented number of cards The tournament had a record number of yellow and red cards, breaking the previous record set by the 1998 World Cup. Players received a record, breaking 345 yellow cards and 28 red cards with Russian referee Valentin Ivanov handing out 16 yellow and 4 red cards in the round of 16 match between Portugal and the Netherlands. In a match known as the Battle of Nuremberg, Portugal had two players suspended for each of the quarter-final and semi-final matches, respectively. FIFA president Sepp Blatter hinted that he may allow some rule changes for future tournaments so that earlier accumulated bookings will not force players to miss the final, should their teams make it that far. The tournament also saw English referee Graham Pohl mistakenly hand out three yellow cards to Croatia's Josip Šimunić in their match against Australia. The high number of yellow and red cards shown also prompted discussion about the referees. FIFA officials and President Sepp Blatter received criticism for allegedly making rules too rigid and taking discretion away from referees.